What's up guys, Boris here and today I'm coming to you guys with a free-to-play team for the new Absalom 30 Stamina Dungeon. Now this team's gonna revolve around the combo of we got Polly, we got Ms. Valentine, and Cock. Now those three will combo really well. I'll actually give you all uh, blue orbs and boost it uh, when you get to the boss. And we're gonna use Rob Lucci for his times to attack to all of the blue units, and then we're gonna use an ace friend captain. So all these uh, characters are farmable. Hopefully you guys have picked them up at some point. And um, let me just go <laughs> and show you guys uh, how this combo wrecks the boss. But before we do that, we have to actually get to the boss. I will say that if you don't have um, Ms. Valentine or Polly, you don't have that combo. There is a, a blue marine, or not a blue marine, a blue fodder unit that you could actually have gotten from the Perona dungeon. Um, the one I believe he has like a, like a staff or something. He, he will change all tandem orbs to blue orbs. So that's what you're looking for really is changing all tandem orbs to blue orbs. Polly will change all of tandem orbs to food orbs, and his Valentine will change all food orbs to blue orbs. So it ends up doing the same thing for two uh, different units. So that's uh, another uh, possibility that you could use. Now, uh, you do want to do a little bit of stalling, so you make sure you have your special ready and time and everything for the boss, but it really doesn't require too much as long as you have, uh, you don't even need that many skill. Uh, actually, you might need a couple of. Uh, you know, a couple of skill ups on Kaku, but if you don't, then again, just you can probably stall him enough to get his uh, ready for uh, the, the final boss of this run. Now, here is the whole trick to the dungeon, and that is the fact that you will blind your team uh, for the rest of the run at this point. So, you just have to be comfortable with your specials. You know, hopefully, you've practiced enough with your blue units to be able to hit those perfects. To be honest, you don't really even need perfects, you could use uh, greats, this should be fine as well. Uh, the whole point is you just want to keep that multiplier going. And one last thing is that you want to try to farm for the blue orbs for the final room. It'll be really helpful. So like always, guys, I'll see you guys in just a little bit at the boss. Okay, it's boss time. Now, Absalom, he's actually pretty tanky, so the first thing we're going to do here is go ahead and use Kaku's special. Like I said, if you farm for some blue orbs, it'll be perfect. If you do not have any blue orbs, you can go ahead and wait until next turn to use it. Uh, and I'm going to use Usopp here to stall. And I just want to remember, guys, that Kaku's uh, special is that it boosts orbs uh, by 1.5 times for two turns. So it'll last this turn and the next turn. And the reason this is important is because right now, Absalom will change all my orbs to tandem orbs. Normally this sucks, but... Polly will give us the ability to change all those tandem orbs to food orbs, and then Miss Valentine will change all those food orbs to blue orbs. So now we have an entire team of boosted uh, characters here to be able to take down Absalom uh, within the three turns that we have. Now, as you'll see here, you could probably take him out on that turn if he had perfects, <laughs> although, like I said, with a blind, it's pretty tough. So there it is Absalom, 30 stamina, pretty easy. Again, if you don't have that combo of Miss Valentine and Polly, you can go ahead and try to get that fodder uh, you know, character that. Changes tandem to blue, and it'll be easy as well. That's it, guys. Hopefully, you enjoyed this free-to-play tutorial, and until next time, peace.